JetBlue just pissed off every Black Lives Matter thug with what they painted all over their airplanes in a time where most airlines are frowned upon. An American-based airline just won a whole lot of fans. JetBlue, which is the only airline based out of New York, has painted one of its Airbus A320s showing respect for the heroes at the NYPD. It sports the NYPD flag which has green and white stripes that symbolize the five boroughs. The tail shows the 24 stars which represent the 23 separate towns and villages which came together in 1899 to become what is the New York City of today. The 24th star symbolizes the city itself. This is a huge blow to the terrorist Black Lives Matter movement. Who the more they try to generate sympathy for their non-existent cause, the more law-abiding Americans rebel against them. In fact, in a recent poll, it was found that only 31% of African Americans actually agree with the Black Lives Matter message of division and anarchy. Each weekend at least 20 young black men are shot in the city of Chicago yet Black Lives Matter, Al Sharpton, and Jesse Jackson are 100% silent. Sure, it's not newsworthy nor is there any money to be made when a black man shoots a fellow black man. It's about time black people band together, not against the police who are 99% good, but against the media whores and profiters who make their living off of keeping them down, like most of today's Democratic Party. It's about time black people band together, not against the police who are 99% good, but against the media whores and profilers who make their living off of keeping them down like most of today's Democratic Party. Time for black America to say enough and see that the police and the man aren't the reason they are where they are. The real reason begins with the fact that 72% of black babies are born without a father at home. Fix the black family issue, and like dominoes, most of the problems will topple and fall. Final Call reports, Happy Father's Day Daddy reflects the sweet sentiment of a child's greeting as dad slowly awakens to a beautiful voice draped with love and admiration. But, for many black men and their offspring across America, this experience is only a dream because large numbers of black men are not blessed to be in the home with their children, nor in their lives. Unfortunately, there are millions of instances where the absence of a father contributes to generations of children who grow up with broken dreams, lonely moments staring out of windows waiting for dad to show up, or looking up in the stands during graduation or sporting events. They are hoping to see dad cheer them on. These painful realities are case studies of children who are not connected to their fathers. According to Dr. Francis Cress Welsing, the well-renowned black psychiatrist who recently spoke at the Better Family Life Educational Culture Center in St. Louis, black families are in a crisis situation by design. White-dominated society works to purposely disconnect black fathers from their families, she said. So more often than not, children are left to get caught up in a bitter cycle of poverty, high school dropout, drugs, and gang violence. No father is there to help them navigate through difficult circumstances and hard times. The percentages of single-parent homes headed by women have been shown to have a direct connection to and greater likelihood for living in poverty engaging in crime and suffering psychological damage and issues. One study of single and married mothers over a two-year period chronicled and measured psychosocial risk factors, problems with depression and crisis episodes. The risk for the onset of depression was double among single mothers as opposed to married women. Single mothers were also twice as likely as their married counterparts to be in financial hardship despite being twice as likely to be in full-time employment. They were also more likely to exhibit poor self-esteem and lack of support, both of which were also more common among single mothers, said George W. Brown, in an article for the Cambridge Journal. This study clearly shows how important it is for a father, who represents a model of strength in the eyes of a child, to be present in their lives. So to all the men who are lost without their children or who have lost contact with their children, Let's follow a good example in front of us and take up our responsibility as fathers, husbands, and men in our communities. Please do not forget to subscribe and like and comment because we want to hear your voice and thank you for watching.